What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Check this thing out. This thing is awesome. I mean look at this thing. I just unboxed it. I, uh, I actually have been playing. I gotta admit I have been playing with it uh, before I made the video. Sorry I got a little ahead of myself. Uh, but this is the Jackery 1000. This device is incredible. And the reason why I'm saying it's incredible and everything is, well, I've just been playing with it just a little bit, uh, you know, tested it with some stuff, and it's lasted a while. Uh, for it being only especially 1,000, and the uh, the battery, you know, I mean, this this thing is tiny. It's only 22 pounds, you know, for the size of it. you think this thing wouldn't last you at all. But this is the all-new Jackery 1000. There will be a link in the description if you guys want to purchase it. Um, if they are sold out, I am sorry. These things, as soon as they start selling, they sell out immediately, uh, very, very quick. But uh, first look of this thing is right away, I like how small it is. You know, it's it's tiny. It's 22 pounds. You can pick it up, you know, take it wherever you want with you. It's not a massive, like, generator, Honda 2000 generator, because that's what everybody's going to want. Uh, here's a little um, suction, and then this is your fan, just blows out. You got a little flashlight. Probably never use that in my life for a flashlight. That's a pretty big uh, flashlight. But uh, right now I am charging it by the. Oh, oh, oh. Right now I'm charging it by the pack here, uh, not the solar. And you'll see um, I'm gonna do the solar also. But I'm gonna run this thing down uh, to I don't know like 20, 30 percent, and then I'm gonna hook it up to the solar panels and see. This is the plug right here for the uh, the panels. You just plug that into there. Plug your panel in, bada bing, bada boom. And then it has three 110 outlets here. Check it out right there. And yes, pure sign inverter. It has USB-C uh, ports, two of them here. And then a USB uh, here, and then a USB quick charge 3.0 down here with a cigarette lighter, which is nice, they put a cap. I think I saw their older model, didn't have a cap. So Jackery, good job for putting a cap on that. Um, to engage, all, well engage, to turn it on, turn it on, the, all the stuff, you can call it whatever you want. Uh, you just push this top button. See that? Bam. That turns it on, green light, turns it off. You want to kick on these 110? Bam, you hear the fan? It just kicked on and then shut off real quick. And um, we're going to be using this thing with solar and without solar. Uh, we're going you know, to test this thing out because... If you guys have a toy hauler and don't want to deal with batteries, extra batteries and, and um, inverters and all that, I would just use this thing, man. I mean, this thing is awesome. Now, 1,000 watts, not going to run your AC, but if you're going to, you know, most likely, if you guys are boondocking as me only in the winter, this thing is going to work perfect for you because, well, the desert, you don't need AC. And when we go camping here in the um, summertime, I, where you, I'm usually at campgrounds, so you know it's I got plugged in. But if you're boondocking and you want to just power, this will work great. If you want AC, it's not going to work though. Check out these panels. Look at this. You just they got a little handle. Lift it up. That's easy. Wow, this doesn't weigh anything. This is awesome, man. Jackery did a great job. Magnetic. Look at that. Whoop. This guys is a very very good thing to have, especially if you lose power. And you just need some, you know, sort of power or some power source. This is the way to go. All right, so now let's go play with this thing. I'm gonna take it outside. Uh, I'm gonna use this right now. Hook it to the uh, the trailer, and I'm gonna I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna drain this battery and see how long it takes. All right, guys. So here's the panels. I gotta say these things are extremely light. And what's cool is when you close these things up, they just magnet together. It's very easy. It's got a handle. I mean, the thing weighs nothing. So that's pretty cool. This was, I don't know, 10 seconds to set up. It's got stands back here. So if you guys are camping and you want to set it up, you can stand it wherever you want. Uh, you can probably, well, so it's sort of one angle, but if you, you know, push it more like that and push it more like that, you can tilt it up depending, you know, if the sun is getting low and you want to tilt it up. But right now, like I said, it's about 3.30, 4 o'clock. So the sun is, there's the sun. It's pretty much pointing right at the panel right now. So we're gonna do, we're gonna hook them up and see, you know, how fast this thing can charge. And it's got little pockets back here. So in the pocket, when you open the pocket up, this is the plug, I would assume it's going to plug into that adapter. So let me pull this out here real quick, get this set up for you guys, and uh, I will show you how it's charging. Okay, so we just plugged it in. It does not matter which way, uh, or which one you plug it in. 
but right now it is look at that so I don't know if you guys can see that right there they're 100 watt panels a piece so we're at a hundred and 19 watts it's charging so it's at 29 percent so we're going to charge these using the solar panel and see you know what it does we'll wait we'll wait an hour and see what it does it's at 29 percent and we'll go from there but now guys the goal you know with the system is to see if you can before you go on a camping you know and say you're gonna go i don't know friday till sunday or thursday till sunday whatever is what i want to see i'm going to charge it full now, without charging, I'm talking no charging at all. Say you don't even want to bring the, the, the panels with you at all. Just say, ah, you want to charge it, see if it'll last you. You know your regular routine. So what I'm going to do here is we're going to charge it full, and then I'm going to see, and I'm going to use it uh, and, and see, you know, what, what, what can I do for for how long? When is this thing going to die, you know, after having a fridge, TV, everything on, and see how long it can go for uh, without using the panels. Now, I'm sure with these panels, and it's been about five minutes, uh, it's went from 29 to 31%, so let's wait, you know, wait a couple hours and see uh, what it does. All right, let's check on these. So we put these on at 4 o'clock. It is now 6.20. So let's see, in that amount of time, it's at 55%. So from 29 to 55 And remember, guys, one thing about these is you don't want to let them die, you know. And with any battery that I deal with, I usually try to always keep it you know pretty much full I mean same thing with like a cell phone laptop those batteries don't like to go go you know or get low and completely drain uh, they like to stay full the same thing with like the RC cars that we do you know keep them full so uh, the only pretty much thing that you know I mean yeah your phone I try to even with my cell phone try not to let it die but I mean if you keep this topped off and this wattage you see is dropping because we're hitting some shade from the uh, trees over there we'll move it but um you know if you keep it topped off i don't know we'll see uh, how long it lasts but i'm going to charge it up overnight and then we're going to play with it tomorrow hook it up to the trailer and see how it is but as of right now dude this thing is awesome i mean this system it's easy light very simple to use so we'll see how it does with the toy hauler So guys, if you're wondering what is running all the uh, the TVs, we got this TV on, we got this TV on. Yep, it's the Jackery. So a little update. I've been playing with this thing uh, over the weekend and stuff. So I left this thing on at night, all night, both TVs on. Uh, I turned it on. I want to say at about nine o'clock, and then I came to check on it at about two o'clock. And from nine to two, with all the TVs on, it was at seventy percent. So I gotta say, I'm very, very impressed on it. Um, the real true test will be this weekend when I actually, you know, and you use this thing. But right now we're just, we're testing it out uh, to see, you know, if it can really run everything in an actual toy hauler. But right now I got the solar uh, hooked up to it. So we're pulling with the TVs on, lights on, 100, only 162 watts. And the solar right now is charging at 105 watts right now. So, I mean, for a trailer, guys, I, I, this thing is, if you don't deal with the fuel, you know, deal with the noise. Uh, one thing, one problem that I would have is when people would come here and they would sleep, you know, this turns into a bed or sleep here, this turns into a queen bed. Well, what sucked is I'd have my generator right on the other side, you know, so they can watch TV and stuff like that. Uh, well, they couldn't stand it because of the noise and how loud it was running all night. So, uh, you know, I mean, if you're going to get a Honda 2000, you're going to pay 1100 bucks. I believe the Jackery was 999 or 899 uh, I'll double check for you guys. And there will be a link down in the description if you are interested in it. But, again, uh, I'm going to do more tests with it. But as of right now, this thing is amazing. And you got your panels out here just soaking up sun, making you free power. Another thing about this, guys, that's why it's really, really good and what really caught my eye, it's an actual pure sign inverter. You know, this will actually give you clean power. That's what's nice about having a pure sign inverter, not a modified. Uh, but I got to say, I mean, for um, this thing, for how small is how easy everything is, if you guys got a toy hauler, man, I mean, I, I look into this. This is a pretty amazing product. All right, let's get a little, another update for you guys on this. We still got stuff on. We got fans running. It's been about four hours. And look at that. 88%. Wow. 
I gotta say guys, this thing is it's pretty amazing. Well, as of right now, guys, I'm loving this thing. It's doing good. Uh, you know, it's powering everything, powered all the TVs, uh, did the coffee maker. But again, the true test will be this week, and I'm going to use it and pretty much see how it can do without... I'm going to try not to start the generator in here. But again, if I need air conditioning, it's, uh, it's got to start it. Start the generator because that's not going to run both ACs. But we're going to do more tests with this jacket. As of right now, this thing is amazing. Uh, it's you know running the whole toy hauler. I can't imagine you know if you guys have power outages, plug your fridge in or run your fridge. It's a nice little you know product because number one you can charge it with the sun, and number two you can bring it in the house or use it in your backyard. Don't have to deal with the generator starting up and dealing with fuel. So that's all I got for you guys today. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys like this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button over to click subscribe. Peace. Yeah.